A new era of life, we're becoming an adult! <laughs> Jojo Siwa has once again caught the public's attention, this time stirring up even more controversy. She's in the midst of a significant shift in her content, and recently she's taken a bold step by advising her young followers to steer clear of her new material, deeming it unsuitable for them. This cautionary message was prominently displayed on her Instagram, serving as a clear warning for kids to avoid her latest endeavors. However, this transition hasn't garnered universal support. Many of JoJo's fans are expressing deep concerns about her well-being. They're troubled to the extent that they're claiming JoJo has transformed so dramatically that she's hardly recognizable anymore. JoJo is no stranger to stirring up controversy. It seems like hardly a week goes by without her making headlines for something controversial. Nonetheless, it caught many by surprise when she took to Instagram to issue a stark warning advising children to steer clear of her upcoming content. The warning read, The following content is not made for children and may be disturbing and offensive to some viewers. Viewer discretion is advised. I'm not kidding when I tell you that JoJo is staying true to her warning. Following her rather direct message, she teased her upcoming song Karma through a series of hints. JoJo even opened up about her desire to transition towards creating more mature content, expressing her dissatisfaction with her previous era. She didn't hold back in revealing some lyrics from her song, confirming that she meant it when she advised kids to stay away. Just the chorus alone provides a glimpse into this new direction for JoJo. It says karma is, I should have known better. If I had a wish, I would have never asked around. When I saw the picture of you and her, I felt the knife twist, and she's with you right now. All along, it seemed like JoJo was emphasizing her transition into adulthood and moving away from her Nickelodeon past. Jo, as she's now known, has shed her previous image as a child star and fully embraced her grown-up persona. She even talks about how bad she has been in the first verse of the song, saying, I was a bad girl. I did some bad things. I swear I did it all for fun, and it meant nothing. It never happened. It was a secret. Like when a tree falls in the forest, no one hears that. Another late night, another crazy mood, and I didn't think twice what it would do to you. I was a wild child. You always knew it. It was a matter of time before I blew it. Not everyone is on board with the edgier version of JoJo. As she hyped up the release of her song, Jo made sure to emphasize the adult themes, which didn't sit well with everyone. Some people took offense when she posted a picture flipping off the camera, and her use of profanity in the song only exacerbated the situation. Just glance at the comments on JoJo's posts, and you'll see that not everyone is thrilled about these changes. This song sounds like it should be in the background of Kim K's Hollywood game. It sounds like reality show music. It sounds like Fortnite default emo music. It sounds like robot fashion game music. While it might seem like JoJo's transition to a more adult image is recent, it's been a gradual process. As far back as 2020 or 2021, she began shedding her Nickelodeon persona. This was evident when she made a red carpet appearance wearing a black dress and high heels, a departure from her usual style. While it's common for celebrities to dress up for such events, JoJo's choice marked a noticeable shift for her. She herself acknowledged this change in her appearance. I am in a dress and feels for the first time in my life when I knew I was coming to the Amas, I was like, oh, what am I gonna wear? Because I have had this transition while being on Dancing with the Stars where I've gone from dressing like I normally dress to looking more adult. Moving forward to the present day, Jojo has unquestionably matured into an adult, yet she's miles away from the Nickelodeon persona she once embodied. Her current appearance bears little resemblance to the young star who graced the red carpet in 2020 or 2021. In fact, a side-by-side -side comparison of Jojo then and now might lead you to believe they're entirely different individuals. Presently, Jojo sports a sleeve of tattoos, exudes a more subdued demeanor, and employs language that's definitely not suitable for a workplace setting. Given these significant changes, it's understandable why people are expressing concerns about her well-being. In late February, Jojo intensified her promotion for Karma by sharing a TikTok video capturing her reaction to a significant meeting. She expressed anticipation about sharing exciting news with her fans following the meeting. Subsequently, she heavily promoted karma, leading some to believe she may have overdone it, resulting in her own fans labeling her as annoying. 
Additionally, comparisons between the new JoJo and Miley Cyrus during her twerking phase began to surface. Transitioning from child stardom to adulthood isn't easy, as seen with stars like Miley Cyrus and JoJo. Having been in the spotlight from a young age, they were perceived in a certain light by the public. Naturally, as they mature and undergo significant changes, not everyone remains a fan. JoJo's transition seemed rapid, particularly as she went from her trademark multicolored hair to sharing more adult-oriented content, such as recent photos. The transformation in JoJo's image happened so swiftly that a quick scroll through her Instagram feed reveals the stark contrast. Her once bright and vibrant pictures have evolved into darker and edgier ones. However, it's important to note that this change isn't necessarily viewed negatively. Ultimately, JoJo has the right to express herself however she chooses. It's her life, after all. That said, considering the image she's maintained for so long, some argue that such significant changes should occur more gradually. It's no surprise then that discussions in her comments section over the past couple of weeks have been chaotic, with people debating the merits of this transition. I think she's trying to tell us she's channeling her inner Miley and we'll be talking pretty soon. Rob, what the hell happened to JoJo 10 years ago? She was cute and awesome, but to JoJo like Nicki Minaj, the whole hashtag. Bring old JoJo C out. We got it. You're growing up, but be classy, not trashy. Don't really expect these celebrities that start out as young kids. Same being and acting like a child. I mean, what do you expect when they become adults? Like, be for real. Let her live and most importantly, let her be herself for a change. She probably spent her whole childhood and even teenage years being this person that everyone wanted her to be. And she did that for y'all. Now let her do her for a change and most importantly for herself, OMG, you judge her for being a kid and now she grows up and you all still have an issue with her. What does she need to do to gain your respect? It's fair enough to judge her, but to then give her no chance to make it right now. Give her a chance to explain. You've already judged her. It's wrong. People just don't like that. She grew up. But let's be real. Someone JoJo's age can't stay that innocent kid forever. She's an adult now. She's allowed to explore and experiment. It's okay. She's a young adult who's finding herself after being this kid for half of her life. So please, if you can't accept growth, just unfollow and stay off her social. She deserves nothing but praise and encouragement in this big moment in her life. Let Jojo grow and figure out who she is without holding her past against her. Jojo has faced her fair share of recent drama, particularly surrounding her past involvement with the OMG Pop group. Allegations surfaced from an ex-OMG Pop member accusing Jojo of displaying poor behavior behind the scenes. It's claimed that Jojo acted in a domineering manner, insisting on having things her way without consideration for others. Reports suggest that JoJo would direct insults towards fellow OMG pop members during performances, fostering a toxic and competitive atmosphere within the group. Even off-camera, she allegedly instigated conflicts among group members. Sources consulted by Rolling Stone involved in JoJo's reality show production revealed discrepancies between promises made to the group members and the reality of their situation. Furthermore, JoJo purportedly rented a house for the ex-OMG pop members to collaborate on content, but none of them ended up staying there. Instead, JoJo had the house to herself, exacerbating the situation. The individual who exposed JoJo's behavior claimed to have experienced financial struggles, resorting to sleeping on a gym mat in a dance studio with her mother due to financial constraints from lack of payment. JoJo has faced criticism for her choice of friends, including figures like James Charles and Colin Ballinger. Last year, she received backlash for defending Colin, which led to some friction in her social circle. Recently, JoJo stirred more controversy by announcing her desire to have children within the next few years, revealing that she already had a sperm donor lined up. However, not everyone reacted positively to JoJo's announcement. Trisha expressed concerns about JoJo's readiness for parenthood, citing her perceived immaturity. Trisha pointed to JoJo's history of defending controversial friends as evidence, suggesting that these associations have contributed to JoJo's reputation as one of the Internet's most controversial figures. Trisha emphasized the need for JoJo to mature further before taking on the responsibility of motherhood. JoJo seems to be at a stage in her life where she may not be fully equipped to take on the responsibilities of parenthood. Despite facing numerous controversies this year, JoJo has remained silent, 
indicating a level of awareness about her negative reception online and a lack of concern about it. It's evident that JoJo is aware of the controversy surrounding her image transition and appears committed to continuing on this path, seemingly beyond the point of reversal. However, the long-term consequences of this transition remain uncertain. Will JoJo ultimately find herself as Miley Cyrus did, or will things take a turn for the worse? What are your thoughts on this new iteration of JoJo? Feel free to share your opinions in the comments below and be sure to keep up with my other videos to stay informed about the latest developments.